Hello and welcome to Denslet, a channel for intelligent and curious people like you who are searching for the mystery of relationship between human and robots and humans in the age of artificial intelligence. And not only that, there are more. There are a lot of things that we try to cover in this channel. So before we proceed, let me tell you one thing. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And if you have already subscribed, please keep supporting me by sharing with your friends, by giving me a thumbs up, and of course, leaving your comments, good, bad, anything. I would appreciate that. We'll today discuss the role of our legs in physical intimacy. You know, in any kind of physical activities, role of legs play a very important role. In fact, legs play a very important role. Therefore, the role of legs are very important. And it is not uh, different for uh, human and robot partners, of course, because they have adaptable leg joints. And adaptable leg joints in a human and robot are critical components that allow the robot to move and navigate diverse environments with greater agility and stability. It mimics the flexibility and adaptability of our legs. Okay. Because scientists and technologists and engineers, while creating the robots or robot partners, they basically mimic the flexibility and adaptability of our legs and create the robot legs in that way. These joints, that means the leg joints, from it, you can start it from the pelvic region and then the knees and etc. Uh, all the other parts, other joints. These joints go beyond the basic hinge-like movements of traditional robot legs. You have seen the traditional robot legs, that means uh, those uh, were uh, a little bit uh, more robotic, not less human. But in this case, it incorporates additional degree of freedom and advanced materials to achieve a wider range of motion and adjust to uneven terrain obstacles and dynamic situations. That means it can, uh, now our robot partners can walk from dining room to bedroom. It's not a, not a problem, it's an even surface. But if you take it to the garden, which is uneven surface, it can walk there also. Not only that, on the bed, it can perform any kind of physically intimate acts by uh, move, moving their legs due to this adaptable leg joints. Okay, so this is an introduction kind of thing, uh, and we know that how the adaptable leg joints in human and robot are critical components uh, that allows the robot to move and navigate diverse, uh, not only diverse environments with greater agility and stability, but it can mimic the human legs as it is, as if uh, you, you will find that these are human legs. Okay. So the, today, this much because I want to create uh, more short videos and give you more information in every video so that you can form a 360 degree view of your robot partner. Thanks for watching again and please keep supporting me uh, and uh, share with your friends. So see you soon in the next video. Till then, stay safe and take care.